welcome to the Texas Children's Hospital Power Science Lab here at the Children's Museum of Houston. I'm Allie, the life science educator. And I'm Jen, the math educator. And we're here to do an experiment that you can do at home. It's called Neutralization Reaction. So what we're going to do in this experiment is we're going to learn how our body digests food in a visual sense, working with specific chemicals. So what are we using today? All right, today we're going to be using baking soda, cabbage extract, and lemon juice. Now, don't worry, if you don't have all these items, that's okay. Allie, what am I gonna do if I don't have cabbage extract or lemon juice at home? So you can actually do the entire experiment without cabbage extract, but if you wanna make some at home, all you have to do is chop up a little bit of red cabbage, about a fourth of a cup, and boil it in some water. And that water will turn purple, and that is exactly what our cabbage extract is. And let's say you don't have any lemon juice. You just need a different acid. So you could use vinegar, white, or apple cider will work. Awesome, I think I'm ready to get started. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about how our body digests food. The first thing we do when we put food into our body, we put it into our... Mouth! Exactly, and we chew it and chew it mechanically, breaking down that food, and we swallow it. Down into our... Stomachs! Stomachs! And there, our stomach secretes something called hydrochloric acid. Whoa, Allie, hydrochloric acid seems really scary. Actually, it's a level two pH, so that means it's a very strong acid. But don't worry, it's contained within our stomach. And that actually is used to break apart our food chemically. Cool. So once we've, break it up, we've broken apart our food chemically, you can actually, it'll actually secrete down into our small intestines. But our small intestines can't handle that much acid. So what it has to do is secrete something that neutralizes that acid called bicarbonate solution. Whoa, what's a bicarbonate solution? That's a really good question, Jen. The bicarbonate solution is actually a basic solution that when it touches the acidic solution, it neutralizes it and is very similar to baking soda. So let's go ahead and start our experiment. What we're going to do is add some lemon juice to Whoa, 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 whoa! Allie, you forgot about your eyes! Oh no! I remembered! Thank you, Jen! Make sure that you are wearing your safety gear for during experiments. Today we are wearing goggles or safety glasses. If you don't have any safety glasses or goggles at home, that's okay. You can actually use swimming goggles because they'll protect your eyes just as well. Great. Now we can begin. Finally, love safety. So let's go ahead and pour some lemon juice into our cup. About halfway is good. Now what we're going to do is add some cabbage extract and that's gonna turn our lemon juice Pink! Exactly! Great job, Jen! So it turns it pink because our cabbage extract is a pH indicator, meaning that it's going to tell us what solution it's sitting in is an acid or a base. So if it's pink, that means it's sitting in an acidic solution. If it's purple, that means it's sitting in a neutral solution. And if it turns greenish yellow, that means it's sitting in a basic solution. So. Right now we have our pink solution and it's all acid, just lemon juice. And we're about to secrete that lemon juice from our stomachs into our duodenum, which is our small intestines, and our small intestines has to neutralize it. So we're gonna add a really big spoonful of baking soda. Whoa! And I'm gonna add just a little bit more. Cause we, we like gonna... things big and explosive. Exactly, so what do you see happening, Jen? I see that lots of bubbles are forming and I can see that the baking soda is mixing in with the solution. Exactly, so those bubbles, whenever you mix an acid and a base, they'll neutralize together to form salt and water and sometimes <laughs> gas. <Yes>. Oh. <laughs> so and if you notice, what color is that solution now, Jen? It almost looks like a greenish color. That means it's slightly basic now. So, we neutralized that acid. That's so awesome. I love learning new things. Thanks for joining me, 
Jen. Thanks for joining us, everyone.